The Punchestown cha champion Chase is next. And that's a bad sign. My throat's going on really. It's only the third race of the week, and Stu is not available today. So, two mile grade one carried off need at the top for David Robertson, Cock and N10, Derek Hinton, Game On, David Hooley, The Mighty Mouse, Joshua Sutherland, Call Me Angel, Patrick Hogan, Fuente Minette, Darren Thompson, Last Hurrah, Leon Van Rensburg, and Red Raffle for Stu Gray. Called in and away. And heading towards the first then. It looks like he's going to be Call Me Angel. Who's going to lead them into it? They've got 10 to take. The third two mile on the trot. And this is the first one over the big obstacles. And Call Me Angel passes the winning post and heads towards the first of the 10. It's a good old run to the first. Cock and Hen 10 is in second. And then carried off need. They finally make it to the first, which they're all safely over. Red Raffle just the back marker at this early point. Call Me Angel, who's in the lead. By about two for Padre Hogan. Into the second. And over that one they all go nicely. With Fuente Minette just, just about showing the second, but it's all virtually four in a line. And with Mighty Mouse, Fuente Minette, and Game 1 and Last Hurrah as they get to the third. Which they all get over nicely as well. The back three carried off need. Cock and Hen 10 and Red Raffle. Call Me Angel who goes into this ditch with a clear lead. And we'll safely over that one as well. Mighty Mouse has moved into second. Game on is third. Fuente Minette four. Then last two raw. Carried off need Red Raffle. And finally now Cock and Hen ten. Just the back marker. Derek Hinton obviously a bit of, fancies himself as a bit of a bingo caller. I think he fancies himself as a bit of a race caller. Might do a bit of commentating next season, Derek. That could be bit of fun as they get over the fifth and oh, they're all safely over that one although Fuente Minette didn't jump it all that well. Call Me Angel continues to lead the Mighty Mouse in second and last two raw and game on. He's carried off need as they get to the sixth and oh, there's a couple of bad mistakes there. Last to raw for Leon Van Rensburg and Fuente Minette for Darren Thompson at the back both hit that fence really hard. They come down to the fourth from home now, and this time it's the leader that goes straight through it. Padre Hogan's Call Me Angel hit that really hard, and that's left Mighty Mouse clearing the lead. So Mighty Mouse is two lengths clear then now with three to jump. Call Me Angel has switched to the outside, seems to have regained his equilibrium quick, quite quickly and comes back to regain the initiative. There's a gap of about three lengths then to Game On, who's back in third. Then comes Red Raffle, who's moved through into fourth as they take the third last. The leader jumped it much better this time and got away from the Mighty Mouse and opened up with a two to three length lead and seems to be going really strongly in the lead now. Call Me Angel racing down towards the final four furlongs and it's Call Me Angel who's four or five clear over the final ditch. That's the second last but he jumped it a bit slowly. Mighty Mouse is in second. The last two riders in third. Fuente Manette's recovered on the outside. It's now fourth. Then carried off need. Game on. Didn't pick up. Red Raffle is next. Cock on N10 is tailed off. But it's Call Me Angel who's still in the lead. But he's now being strongly pressed by the Mighty Mouse. And last two riders they come towards the final fence. Fuente Manette on the outside is going strongly as well. But it's last two riders in front. Last two riders going to lead into the final fence. From Fuente Manette on the outside. Fuente Manette jumped it better. But so too did Mighty Mouse. Mighty Mouse and Fuente Manette. They come inside the the final furlong. It's Mighty Mouse. Fuente Manette on the outside. Fuente Manette is beginning to get up. Fuente Manette by a banner net. And Fuente Manette is going to race to the line and take it, I think, from a fast finishing game on. Fuente Manette. Oh, and come back at him again. They came back at him again there, but I think he hung on. Fuente Manette, the winning post. A little bit further past the last one on the hurdle course. And I think he's held on Fuente Manette. Yeah, just about by about a nose. Game on was trying to give David Hooley another winner, but it's a Fuente Minute for Darren Thompson that takes it. Game on second for David Hooley. Mighty Mouse, Joshua Sutherland third. Red Raffle and a big race for Stu Gray in fourth. And carried off need for David Robertson was fifth.